I am the senior computer analyst in charge of the computer-wide uh, information technology for the school, uh, mainly concentrating in the student services and staff needs. At one time, we only had homegrown uh, systems where we, they were written in-house, and we migrated to a uh, purchase system that we maintained, and then three years later, we migrated to the current system we have now. So I've been through two mi migrations, which use different computer languages. We've had to learn new ways to uh, extract information from the system and provide our users and the students with the tools and data that they need to be successful. I was a high school student here in Corpus Christi that was preparing to go off to college. I didn't really have the means to go away, so I first my first thought was to come to Del Mar. It was affordable, it had a great reputation, and they offered the field of study that I was looking to get into. I needed to be stretched in my career, something that was going to be different and interesting you know, throughout my whole working life. So I knew I was going to come to college with some kind of science or technology major in mind. The instructors here were very open and uh, helpful and it was a real small community at the time. There wasn't a lot of people in uh, information technology or computer science. So um, it just was a natural fit and I really just took to it like duck to water. So There was one particular woman here, Nancy McKinney. Uh, she taught here and I, because I worked full time and came to school at night. She just really never uh, even discussed the gender barrier. It was like, oh, you know, th everybody can do this. If you work hard at it and study, you'll be successful. Uh, I've evolved a lot over the last 25 years. I have two daughters that are both engineers. Um, I strongly encourage any woman that has an interest in science or math or technology to pursue it, to uh, don't be intimidated by the amount of work or the degree of difficulty because the rewards are incredible.